sweet peas today i'm going to be trying a new brand as like a first impressions video so first up we're kind of taking a look at the bottles and the shades that we're going to swatch but this is the brand called lbk nail lacquer they did send these over to me to try and show you guys and that's what we're doing so as you can see they have this like interesting flap on the outside of their lid so you can actually like test the polish on your nail without you know trying the actual physical polish being put on your nail you can kind of just use this little sample swatch and see what it will look like against your skin tone which is a pretty cool like feature i mean it doesn't tell you like how many coats it's going to take or anything but it does kind of help you gauge if it's going to look good on your skin tone which i do like I'm definitely with colors like this because this is like an interesting color it doesn't always work but yeah i think that's a really neat feature these are going to be available now at walmart i was actually at a walmart the other day and they were um 750 or 775 something like that so pretty reasonable but a little higher for walmart also not suggesting we go out to walmart right now but these will be there in the future when you guys go there. So here we have a shade called a Blue Tiful U. And it's a really kind of pretty periwinkly shade. They also do have all these polishes available on their website. So I will link those link that website as well in the description box if you guys want to check that out. I think on the website though they are a little bit more expensive for some reason. So back to this polish. We did need a second coat. It kind of made it closer to full coverage, but I feel like I can still see through in bits and places here and there. So I did go ahead and do a third coat. And at that point, I did feel like I had full coverage and I could see the little sparkle in this polish a little bit more than I could before. So that's really nice. Now the next shade we have is Aquamarine Green. And this is like one of my favorites in this video. It has a really nice formula. It covers really nicely. The brushes on these polishes are also fairly decent. They're not like super wide or anything, but they're easy to work with. And it like applied really nicely in my opinion. This one did kind of dry down to a semi-matte finish, but in that second coat, of course, we did reach full coverage. And then at that point, you can put on a shiny top coat or a matte top coat, whichever you fancy. Then we have Sands of a Beach, and this is a kind of a light coral, light orange shade. It's a really pretty shade that is just kind of hard to describe. I thought it was going to be a bit more coral, but I do feel like it leans a bit more orange. But again, kind of a pastel -y orange, and this has a decent formula as well. It, like... On the camera it looks better than it actually does in real life meaning the second coat here looks like it's full coverage but it's not it actually does need a third coat I feel like you then reach full coverage but before then you can kind of have like these bare patchy spots but it is such a light shade that that doesn't really translate on video very well now we have a last shade called Coco's Cabana and I thought this one was going to be much more neon than it is, but it is just a really nice coral that has a very subtle shimmer in it. And this has a decent formula as well. This one covered in two coats. So this one along with aquamarine green are my two favorites out of these four. And these aren't any collections. They actually asked me what shades I would like to try. So I picked a few. And I feel like two out of four were definitely polishes that I really enjoyed and liked. So here is the final swatches of them. The two, middle two are my favorites. The others are good, but they take a little bit more effort with three coats. So you can kind of gauge that for yourself. But other than that, I think that is all the information I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little swatch video. I have a lot of videos coming up. We're going to have a variety of swatch videos, some art videos, and we're just going to try to have fun de-stress and enjoy this time inside. So I will talk to you guys soon. I hope you're having a wonderful day and I will see you guys back here probably tomorrow. So bye.